Hey, did you ever see this annoying error saying the transaction cannot succeed due to error, execution reverted, pancake router, insufficient output amount? Well, if you are watching this video, it's probably because you have this error and I'm going to guide you on how to solve it. And by the way, so many of my students already asked me how to solve this. So if you want to know more, you can also check my uh, online courses and you have the link on the description below. But let's get into it. So this has to do to the fact that we are using a decentralized exchange and you need to have an order book where the, the buy and the sells, the bid and ask of the price match, right? And if there is not enough liquidity because there is a high volume, high demand or, or high supply uh, of the uh, token, then you, you, you need to increase the slippage. The slippage is the, the slippage that you are willing to pay, the, the difference that you are willing to pay between the current price and what is actually offered to you. So in this case, I'm trying to buy Flocky. By the way, not financial advice, but I'm trying to buy some Flocky. And if I click swap, I get the error and I've put a slippage of 3%, meaning that I'm willing to pay 3% more or less uh, according to this price. And I'm trying to use right PancakeSwap uh, BNB to Flocky. So what I need to do is to increase the slippage. So it's 3% at the moment. I'm going to put it at seven and try again. And if it doesn't work, I'll try again. So let's see. Seems that it prompt my MetaMask. Yeah, confirm. Done. So you see, I increased from three to 7% and now it worked. Not too bad, right? Not too hard. Yeah, and let's check if Flocky is already on my MetaMask. Yeah, it's already here. So that's it. Easy, right? I hope this video was useful. If it was useful, please give me a like and see you next time.